Welcome back with an update on the drought. So let's just dive into the west and it's more improvements for California. More improvements for the west as a whole. Um, and we got more systems coming in. So it's going to probably try to do what it did at the start of the year and pretty much drown Florida or California. Um, Florida's getting a little bit of rain in the next couple days too so that'll help them too. Um, but yeah. It's the wet season. There's going to be major improvements. I just hope we get an El Nino just in time for the monsoon season. As for High Plains, improvements in my area, a little bit. Main improvements appear to be in Colorado and Wyoming. Um, but my area did get a decent rainstorm last night. We've been getting rain throughout the day yesterday. We had rain Tuesday night. I think we also had rain Monday night. Um, and we're looking at possibility of snow tonight into tomorrow morning. So that will help as well. So we could probably see more improvements come next week. Um, as long as we get more rain and snow and whatnot past tonight into tomorrow morning. So we're going to see some more improvements in my area. In parts of Kansas and Missouri, Arkansas. Oklahoma, the four states region here, that, that's what this area calls it, so. As for the Midwest, Kentucky still has that little couple counties in the north, in the western region, um, that has abnormally dry. Once that's done, they're completely drought free, abnormally dry included. Um, got a few pockets in Indiana, Ohio, Illinois, Wisconsin. Wisconsin does have um, moderate drought near Minneapolis, so yeah, there's that. Got the south. Um, Tennessee is drought free. Is Mississippi? Nope, still got a little bit right here, but considering what happened the past couple days, and they're getting more rain today, at least in the morning hours. That will likely be gone come next week, and Mississippi will be completely drought-free. Maybe even the same for Louisiana. May take a little bit more for Louisiana, though. Um, Arkansas might also be in that same boat, where they're probably going to become drought-free. And as is, improvements in Texas and Oklahoma are expected come next week. Um, same goes with the Northeast, with systems coming through. Uh, we got um, Delaware, Pennsylvania... Um, D.C., Connecticut, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, Vermont, New Hampshire, and Maine becoming drought, being drought-free. There's been improvements in New York. Um, and come next week after the system comes through, and they'll probably get a couple other systems come through, we could see in this whole region become drought-free, taking into account abnormally dry. As for the southeast... Yeah, they need rain badly um, to, to just to just nip this down quick. Uh, there's been improvements in South Carolina, um, and probably come next week, South Carolina, maybe Alabama, maybe Virginia, maybe both Carolinas will become drought-free, and probably see more improvements in Florida, particularly in the uh, uh, peninsula. As for the um, western. Alaska, the islands, it got better for Kampang, Gemarangi, but it got worse for like four other islands. It's improving again in Hawaii, and Alaska remains drought free. As for the Caribbean, it's getting a little bit worse. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Stay safe out there. See you in the next video. Bye.